Hey guys, welcome to this week's PHP tutorial where we are looking at how to do PHP directory listing using uh, basic core PHP principles. And then what we'll do is we'll read data out of files from a directory and present it on the command line. So you can use this for building basic scripts for processing data within directories resizing images, whatever you need to do. But if you need to get the list of files in a directory, this is what you would do. So before we get started, I just want to say, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, uh, please do so now and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of these tutorials. So here's what I've done. I've created a basic PHP directory listing folder here. I've created a test directory with two files, one which is test1.txt with the content test1 and the content test2 in test2.txt. Then I created a listing.php file which is currently blank. We'll start writing the code so that we can get this data out of these two files out of this directory. And then you'll be able to just print it on the command line for now. So here's how we get started. We'll start off with the opening tags. And I'm going to show you two ways of doing this. So the first one is using something called scan directory. You can then go and do test directory as your parameter. And just to see what this looks like, we're going to do a print R of the files like this. And let's run this PHP script. So you'll see that it has dot, double dot, and it's got our two files that we want. So the dot is for that current directory and double dot is for the parent. So we want to basically exclude these two because we don't want to read them. We just want to read these two files. So to do that, we'll do something like this. So we'll just loop over the files by saying for each file as uh, files as file like that then we'll basically do an if condition so if the file is either a dot or a double dot then we will just skip over it by using continue and then finally we'll be able to read our file so what we'll do is we'll echo out file get contents so that will read our file and then we need to pass it the directory where we are reading in and we need to append our file name so we'll just append file over here and then at the end we'll just create a new line character so we can print it uh, one below one another save that off and run this and you'll see it's basically gone into this directory read these two files got its contents and it has printed it on the command line for us. So like this, you can actually then go and process files and do all sorts of things in entire directories, making PHP quite useful to take data sets that are in a folder and then being able to do some processing on them. So next, I'm just going to show you how you can do this differently. So I'm going to just do that over here. And for now, I'm going to comment this out. And we will reuse some of this to do it uh, with the other method. So what we need here is a handle. So a handle will basically uh, go ahead and open a directory like this. And then we'll just pass in our test directory. And then we can read our directory. So we'll just say file is equal to read directory. And we need to pass in our handle. And then from there, it's exactly the same as this. We'll run this bit of code in here and then save it. And then let's run it so that I can show you that it is the same thing. So basically there it's now got test one, test two, which is the content of these two files. So those are two different methods you can use to read directories and list files in directories in PHP. Quite simple. So guys, basically that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you liked it. If you did, please like below. And if you have any questions, uh, feel free to ask in the comment section as well. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.